all right guys thank you so much for spending the day with me i hope well it's not the day okay guys that is my weekend vlog that's my very first morning i'm here at the office it is eight o'clock on a saturday january 21st to be exact um i'm only here for a few hours and the only reason why i really came in today is because i'm gonna be off for a couple of days next week as you know for my birthday so i'm just trying to get some things done because i do not want to be contacted on my pto you get the vibes right um what else am i doing today i'm gonna go get my hair done i have some other errands to run grocery shopping birthday shopping who knows let's see stick around <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It is January 22nd. It's Sunday. This is the continuation of the weekend vlog. Let me apologize for just showing most of the footage yesterday and no talking. I'm still new to this, but I'm true to this. So I'm back here today and I'm going to give you a little haul of everything I picked up at Primark. Okay, stick around. All right, let's go. Um, and I'm gonna do this in no part particular order, just how it comes out, how it's packed in the bag. All right, so first up is this cute little zebra stripe bag. Um, this was on sale for seven bucks. At first, I wasn't gonna get it because I thought, you know, it's a little childish. But I like the texture, I like the material. It's very, it's like velvet. But then I thought I could tuck these straps in, right? And get a cute little clutch, you know? I don't know. I kind of liked it. And for $7, like, win-win, right? Oops. Next was this pair of sandals, strappy heels. These were on sale for 10 bucks. Um, don't worry, I'm going to like do a try on and show it somewhere like in a cutaway or something. So yeah, $10, really like those. Okay. 
Next up is this slip dress. I don't know if you can, you can see. Goes all the way down, has a nice little bodice area right here. And this was only $5 on sale. Um, I'm not necessarily the slip dress type, but I'm also, I really like the idea of pairing a girly dress like this with combat boots and like a moto jacket or something. That's more my vibe. So I can't wait to style this up. And also, you know, on a Sunday afternoon like today, I take my shower. This is something I could just lounge around the house in. So for five bucks, I am not mad at this. Next up is this like coral swimsuit with the belt. The belt hits you, you know, it's pretty high waist. This was $16. I got this I think this is a size six but this coming weekend I'm going to Destin Florida for a little birthday getaway so I got this for my trip I'm thinking of doing like a pack with me um, video or you know short or you TikTok kind of vibe to show all you know what i'm packing all the outfits i'm packing so i'm not sure yet so i'll definitely let you know about that one but this is definitely going in the suitcase oops lord let's put it in there this is another item for my trip it's just like a really easy breezy it's not linen at all I'm not seeing the material, but it's it's a beach cover-up. It's pretty lightweight. You know, Florida is hot and humid most of the times. So this is like a beach cover-up for that swimsuit or any other swimsuit because, you know, I plan to be in swimsuits for the entire weekend. So this is great. Hey, we are almost there. I also got this, you know, with the new year, soft life, you know, grown woman vibe. I'm trying to get into more like pajama sets. And this was a really cute one from Primark. And I do believe this was, yeah, this was size six and it's a $22 for both pieces. As I said, I'm gonna be doing a try on, so I'll insert these somewhere. Okay, two more pieces to go. I also got this little, if you know me, and even if you don't, I'm gonna share this today. I love animal print, it doesn't matter what it is. It could be a snake print, a zebra print, tiger, cheetah, I don't know. Crocodile, bring it on. So I saw these like kind of silky type cargo pants. They have like, you can adjust the, the foot, you can adjust the waist. It is high waisted. The only thing I don't like about this, it doesn't have any pockets right here, but you know, these were, this is a size 10. I think I sized up in this one because I like my pants like really slouchy and this was $20. I will also, of course, try this on. And last but not least, I got this cute little cargo style again. Listen, cargo is in, right? Cute little cargo style skirt. I wish it was a score, but I really do love the coral color. I think this is more like my shade of red, if you want to put it that way. I love how it blends with my skin. So um, I got this also. I, I sized up for this one. I got this in a 10 also, the 8 fit. But I really like, you know, I don't want it too tight. I'm trying to move away from the too tight clothing into, you know, a relaxed vibe. I'll insert somewhere.
nothing fancy. I'm just running on the road while my laundry is going. So yeah, let's go run some errands. Okay, so we made it to the car. I need to go to Macy's because I got some star rewards and a couple of gift cards on my birthday. So I'm gonna see what they have there. And, and then I just need to do like quick grocery shopping and come back home to rest and relax. like I'm still sitting in the same place but I just got back home I'm in my parking spot I'm just gonna bring my groceries up and I also stopped at the mall I went to pink and um, like Macy's there was anything here that I needed so I'm back home so yeah let's see what I got I got like this oatmeal creamer. I normally buy the silk brand, but I decided to try this one today. That's Planet Oat. Um, just basic Florida oranges. A sponge for my sink. Some tomatoes. Onion some snapper filet for dinner. I don't know if I ever mentioned it, but I'm now pescatarian. I don't eat meat anymore. So it's just fish and then I'm allergic to shellfish. So no shrimp, no lobster, no crab, none of those things for me. So it's really just fish and vegetables. And then I got a few little Caribbean things. I got like the gunko peas. I got some coconut milk because you can't make rice and peas without coconut milk. I got a little tin mackerel. If you're Caribbean, if you're Jamaican, you know. More fruit. I got dragon fruit. Really love these. I got some cherry tomatoes. I got some cherries. Um lemon i haven't had this in a long time this is like that rye planting chips that I, I used to get back home so i got that some thyme and some vegetable soup mix because i like to make like pea soup or stuff like that to just have in the fridge that i eat at night because like i said i don't eat meat and i don't want to eat fish every day that's pretty much it <laughs> Thank you guys so much if you have made it all the way to this portion of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for spending the weekend with me and I will be posting more frequently on YouTube from now on. Like I said, I'm going to do a pack with me video for my upcoming weekend trip to Destin, Florida. So stick around for that. I'll also be taking you guys along with me to Destin, Florida. So, you know, 
a few more things to come. So thank you so much. And I'm going to take a much needed bath and go relax. Yeah.